I'm Tom Hardy and you're watching the Venom Vlog. 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 The seat, my man. My man here. Thank you guys so much for being fans of the character that we all love so much. Thanks for watching. I enjoyed the show. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka the Venom Vlog. And happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy Venomous. Venomous for the rest of us, right? Uh, this is so awesome. You know, it's been over a year since we've done the show. And I'm very grateful to all of you who have been subscribed here, the new people that have come on, the people that have been here since the beginning, and even people before the Venom vlog who were here when I was doing like Transformer videos and uh, and just other random reviews and stuff. I really do appreciate it. And I know a lot of you guys out there would like more Joker content and more DC stuff and more, you know, more everything else. And unfortunately, with me just being one person, it's, it's already tough enough, especially with like, you know, the surgery and everything I've had going on recently and my work schedule. Uh, it's been tough enough trying to, you know, do it all. So I think in 2019, what I'm going to try to do is just streamline everything, keep it simple, wrap up a couple shows or just do them like one a month or, you know, something like that. And, uh, and that's it. Like Joker will probably just do one episode a month and we'll do all the news that comes out in that month's time. And we'll do it all at the end of the month and talk about all the news that came out. So I might try to streamline things like that. That way I can focus on the Venom vlog because this is the thing that I really enjoy doing. We have so much more history of the character to go through. And obviously we're definitely getting a sequel now because of the massive success of this movie and that's awesome so i want to make sure i'm able to cover all that for you guys and that we cover all the comics you know the cartoons the video games there's still plenty of stuff we haven't got into yet and we got another you know maybe 300 episodes before the next movie actually officially comes out i'm going to try to hit like episode 600 around the time the second movie comes out if not you know past 600 so we have a lot of episodes to come up on this show so i hope you guys stay tuned and stay subscribed and hopefully i keep making content that you enjoy and i always want to hear your feedback so if you ever think i'm deviating from something or, or not hitting the marks like I usually am, feel free to be honest with me in the comments down below and we can definitely, you know, course correct if we need to and I can, you know, pay attention more to what I'm not doing right and, uh, you know, and I, I appreciate the feedback. I know some of you guys are like, ah, just do what you do and, you know, whatever. It's like, yeah, but I want to try to keep getting better and I don't, I'm not very tech smart, so, you know, it's hard for me to come up with other things to do on the show and, and to add new elements to the show, but I will try to learn in 2019 uh, the best I can. And I know a few friends who would be really good teachers at this stuff, so I'll definitely, you know, reach out to them and, and contact them and see if we can't improve the show in some way visually. Uh, but I do have a mic, uh, so that is going to be cool for our, our new reviews. Like when I do, you know, when I have the dual camera, one's aimed at me, and then I have like the, you know, the comic I'm flipping through, I have a mic that will go from my, uh, my computer to like and pinned to my shirt uh, so it's a little lav mic and I can just go right to me and the audio will be much better so I saw that feedback I think Swordsman gave me that feedback on our, one of our videos so I will have better audio next time we do one of the uh, you know flashback reviews uh, so I will probably do those with the verses like Venom vs Avengers Venom vs Iron Man all that stuff I'll probably use it for that so be on the lookout for that in early 2019 uh, and today what I want to do is just say thanks to everyone I'm going to be giving out codes throughout this whole episode so make sure you stay tuned I'm just going to play like maybe Venom at the fireplace and then put like some video footage over it of me building Lego. I actually got all the Spider-Man sets <laughs> uh, for Christmas. Um, we have the Green Goblin set there, the Carnage set here with Miles Morales. Uh, I have the Vulture and Sandman set with Spider-Man 2099. And then uh, my friend Lynn at work, one of my co-workers, she actually purchased this for me, which was really awesome of her, which this is the big Venom set where you can build the giant Venom. We talked about this many, many, many months ago. I think uh, about eight or nine months ago when we saw the picture of it. And then uh, about six months ago at Comic-Con where I got some video footage of it. And so uh, she got this for me, which is really awesome. So thank you, Lynn. Uh, and thank all of you guys for everything, for always supporting, for always watching the shows. And uh, like I said, I'm going to just show, you know, some footage of me building all those. But I just wanted to kind of look at all the Venom uh, stuff that I've had either over the last like two months that I was able to buy or that I, I got for Christmas. And so I have the Scarlet Spider figure. So we still have him here. Uh, mm, mm. Oh. Ah. All right, Ben Riley, you're free and I'm going to eat you now. Uh, so yeah, I got the Ben Riley figure, which is cool. I got this for Christmas, this two pack from my friend Alex and his, actually his parents who are like second parents to me. Uh, they've been really awesome. Alex is one of my best friends and uh, his parents, they always look out for me and they always like, Hey, are you doing okay? Uh, they always check in with me, see how my health is doing. And, uh, they're big, awesome people and I love them very much. And so they sent me this Venom, uh, set here 
that they got online for me, which was awesome because I could never found this at any Targets or Walmarts when I was looking for the Venom figures. I never saw this two-pack, but we did see it at Comic-Con, and I never did see it in person. So they got this for me, and I may open it. I may not. For now, I'm going to keep it closed, but I may open it one day. I don't know. We'll see. You may see them on my shelf back there. I also got this thing here, which is awesome. It is the Disney Store exclusive Venom figure. It looks really cool and we'll maybe we'll take a look at it or I'll do a quick cutaway of what it looks like outside of the box. Uh, I can't eat this whole thing. Uh, plus I only eat Scarlet Spider toys uh, and the boxes that those come in. But uh, yeah, how cool is that? This is really neat looking, has different heads and different molds, uh, little tendrils that come off of them and stuff. It just looked really cool. I liked this a lot when I saw this. I was like, yeah, that's dope. I saw someone post it online and then a friend actually got this for me. So this is really cool. It's been a great Christmas. It's been a great venomous, I guess, uh, Christmas and uh, you you know, I got the movie last week. That was awesome to get that on uh, Blu-ray and DVD. And then I have one other item that I got on eBay, which I won't spoil now, but it is really cool. It's actually a piece of movie memorabilia. And the guy who was selling it on eBay, his name is Chuck. He was selling it for a really good price, but it unfortunately was just too high for me to afford. So I reached out to him. I said, hey, if you don't sell it, like in the next month or two, uh, maybe I can negotiate with you, or maybe by then I'll have more money to spend on it. But I got other things I got to prioritize right now and other bills I got to pay and stuff. Um, and so I said, so I, I, I can't afford what this is, you know, what you're asking for. And uh, and he said, well, you know, let's, let's keep in touch, you know, whatever. And then he wrote me back pretty quickly after and said, you know what? I feel like you're you have to have this i feel like this item has to belong to you and i said i well i don't know where you're getting that feeling from like it, that means a lot but you know i'm sure there's other venom fans out there that'll give it a good home and he's like yeah but you wrote me you wrote me first um you told me about your youtube show i don't know if you checked it out or not but he wrote me back and said i want to give this to you i want to sell it to you and so what can you afford and i said well here's kind of what i can afford now uh if you're willing to wait maybe i can you know make make you know raise it up at some point down the road and he was like no he's like I, he's like that I'm giving he's like that's a really good price uh like you know as far as like uh, what I could afford he was like yeah that's low like you'd be getting it for a really good deal he goes but he's like I, I feel like you should definitely have it so he was nice enough to compromise with me and sell it to me for a really good price and I don't want to spoil what that is uh because we will make a whole episode on it when it comes in the mail but I want to just say Chuck thank you very much from the bottom of my heart for that I don't own a lot of movie memorabilia um, especially something on this level it's going to be very unique it's going to look really cool in my room and I'm very grateful to you this is an actual piece of the Venom movie and I am so so excited to share it with you guys when it comes in so I'll let you know when that happens uh, for sure y'all you'll see me post about it on Instagram and Twitter I'll give you a sneak peek of what it is uh, and then we'll make a video on it soon after uh, but a big Merry Christmas and Happy New Year and uh, you know to Chuck to you guys to everyone who supported this channel I it means so much to me that this show this Venom show has actually uh, been really great uh, for this channel and for me on a, on a personal level uh, to talk about a character that I feel a connection to uh, and to share all that with you guys and find out that you all have connections to this character as well. And it means the world to me that, uh, that a character like this united us all. And hopefully we'll just continue to grow into 2019 and we have Carnage stuff coming up. We got, you know, we're going to talk about Toxin. We're going to talk about Hybrid. We're going to talk about Agent Venom. That's going to be the big thing this year. Most of this year is going to be dedicated to Agent Venom and those uh, Eddie Brock stories that we haven't covered yet. And then into 2020, that's when we'll be getting into the final stretch leading all the way up to the comics that are coming out now, like all the Donny Kate stuff, but the Mike Costa run, we'll talk about more of that into 2020, leading all the way up to the release of the second film. And obviously we'll have a lot more movie information by then too. So again, we're not going anywhere. I, I am so excited to continue the show and I hope you guys are continuing to watch it and enjoy it. So thank you so much again from the bottom of my heart. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and don't go anywhere because the video's not over. I'm going to be cutting now to just a bunch of footage of me building Lego, and you know I'm going to try to speed it up as fast as I can and just do something fun with it. Uh, so I don't know, I'm still working it out in my head, but hopefully you guys enjoy it. And throughout that video clip, you will see uh, up to 10 or 11 digital comic codes pop up. So if you get one, They'll just take the one and try to let you know leave them for other people and then if you get one of the codes and you get the comic let me know down in the comments below which comic you got and if you enjoyed it thanks so much again i will see you next year peace
Thank you. 